when you stop focusing on all the fuckery around you, you're able to bring that attention, that focus, back within yourself. Don't make me expose you to them folks that don't know you. They gotta do you cause nobody will do it for you. I'm trying to tell these cats but I let them do their shit. What is going on my friends? Welcome to Knowledge to Live By. I am Rogelio Diaz and today we are going to discuss focusing on you and getting your life back. Let's get it. Pop. So. You might be asking yourself, okay, Roy, I want to focus on myself. I want to take back my life. But how? How do I do that? Right? (laughs) It starts with two things, my friend. One, noticing, taking note of where you put your time. What do you focus on most of your time? What do you do with it? Do you, you know, scroll to through Instagram? Do you pay attention to what other people are doing with their life? Do you spend a lot of the time with the fuckery? (laughs) When I say the fuckery, I mean doing things that get you nowhere, that serve you no purpose. Or do you spend time within? Do you go for a walk? Do you put on an audio? Do you ask yourself questions to try to improve your life? Where do you put your focus? Because see, what you do with your time will be your life. It will be your reality. So you have to, you have to really take note of what you're you're giving your attention to, all right? Because what you focus on expands. So you focus on, if you start to focus on yourself, your awareness, your consciousness is gonna start to expand. Okay, number two, live with purpose. When you're on your path, when you're on your journey, you, where you just know this is what you're meant to do, you're gonna start to bring back that focus right towards yourself because you're not going to have a choice. You're going to have to think for yourself. You're going to have to think about your next move, where you're going to take your life. And that's going to, again, keep bringing that focus back to yourself. You're going to start asking yourself the right questions, bringing that focus back to yourself. You're going to start taking different actions that are going to help you grow. But if you're focused on watching people that don't, don't level you up, people that bring no value to your life, doing things that bring no value to your life that's what's going to become your life so you have to be aware of these things guys because it's so easy to get distracted right the shit that takes you off your track it's up to you to get your power back aka get your life back and get back on the right path get back on your bike man you know you're going down the road and you see something pretty and you get distracted Like, no, like, you got to have that tunnel vision, man. Like, you got to know where you're headed. That's how you stay focused. Don't let other, your your surroundings or other things that, again, that that do nothing for you, get your attention. Bring it back to you. Go back within. Spend time alone. Do things that, that nurture your mind, that bring value to your mind. Not the opposite. So this is how you, again, start to focus on yourself and you start to take your back, you start to take your life back, control of your life back. Don't just drift through life. Don't just give anyone or anything your attention. You're powerful, man. Your time has value and you have to realize that. Don't just give it away to anything. That's the quickest way to lose self-respect and to have people view you a certain way and not in a positive way <laughs> so i'm telling you man value your time stick to your path live your purpose bro you know you know what you're meant to do and if you haven't if you don't know yet it's gonna come just keep living keep going sooner or later you're gonna find your purpose and you're gonna get on your path man but it all starts now What are you doing with your life? What are you doing with your time? Make sure it's beneficial. And yeah, we all have those days where we just want to chill and, you know, have that ignorant, ignorant, ignorant is bliss type moment. But you got to keep going. You got to get back on your path, man. Because the longer you stay there, you're just going to stay. You're going to stay in that in that mindset for a long time. 
So don't stay there, man. Just get, get back up. Get back on your journey. There's people out there that need you. At some real levels, bro. Once again, thank you for watching, my friends. Today was a short video. I just wanted to really get this message out there and remind you to focus on yourself. Okay? Don't, don't let your, your eyes wander to too many places, man. You got this. I believe in you. I appreciate you. Thank you for all the subscribers. Thank you for all, all the likes, the comments, the shares. Thank you so much. And I do have a special announcement. So I have finally released my first free audiobook, Fighting in the Dark. I, I really think you guys are going to love it. It's going to be in the description box below. Check it out. Download it. Again, it's free. It's my gift to you. And I just, I really think that this can be a foundation for you to go back to. Every time you, you find yourself slipping, you, you find yourself going in a downward spiral, you can play this audio and it'll reset you, man. It'll get you aligned back with your higher self and put you back in that killer zone, that in killer instinct mode, man, where you can do anything. So check it out. Much love, guys. Thank you for, for everything, man. I do this for you. Do it for all of you. Till next time, life was meant to be enjoyed.